I used to be standing in front of a rehab center. Now I'm standing in front of a music recording studio. I do what I do to give hope to others when they feel like their life is over because they've made mistakes. I made hella, hella mistakes, hella mistakes. I lost everything. My house, my health, my husband, my kids. I got most of that stuff back. I'm still working on some of the other stuff. Some of the other stuff is dead. But it's not impossible. Nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible. And I'm about to go in here and murder this beat and get my frustrations out because people have been playing with me my entire life and I am here to wreck shit. I don't like the state of the world. I have something to say, I'm finna say it and get all of my anxiety and my stress out in a positive way and create something that will hopefully reverberate into waves of positive change for the world. And that is why I make music, to spread love and to heal from my trauma. And our producer is late. They're always late. It's all good. I'm grateful. I was supposed to have the session like a month ago, but his schedule, it just didn't work out. You know, car trouble, this, that, and the third. You know, people, everybody are, is out here working with two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven jobs. So, yeah, I, this ain't his only gig, so... I feel him on that, so that just shows me that when I get studio time, don't play with it, don't play with it. Not that I do anyway. I'm just saying. I stuck to my fast. I stuck to my food fast. I had a decaf, peanut butter, chocolate, coffee. I only drank like half of it. And then I have my warm lemon juice with water and agave nectar. Most singers, I'm not calling myself a singer. I sing, but I'm definitely not a singer. Um, use honey and lemon before their sessions. I don't mess with honey no more. It's just too sweet for me. The older I get, sugar, salt, like, you can have it. So, yeah. I'm going to sit out here and just take in the beauty. Well, we're going to get to it pretty far. Mm, pretty. Whatever, it's pretty to me. I don't get outside. When I build my house on my land, I'm going to definitely have gardens with sculptures. I'm going to sit out there and I'm going to pray and dance and sing and write. It's going to be a whole thing. And y'all going to be there. You're going to see me build the life that I want from. Mm -hmm. And you can do it too. I love you. Yeah, see, y'all won't be able to see it. But there is a building behind me. And there is a dude in an all black hoodie watching me on the one two three fourth floor and see y'all be thinking people paranoid i'm not paranoid people really be watching me but that's okay because i'm sitting here watching him do the reflection in this glass and here go my producer so i'll holler at you later Ugh, i'm so tired we did the live it was two hours long i've never copy and pasted a hook but i don't have one more ounce of energy in me to do a separate hook at the end of the song can't do it i'm so emotionally drained <laughs> i'm so emotionally drained and could i probably do better yeah but i don't have it in me like it, it's it's the way that i had it in my head and this has helped me heal so much because every line of the song was true and i went through so much it moves my whole soul to even hear it. But I'm here, and I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to keep making music, and I'm going to keep sharing what I've been through. Because I didn't go through this for nothing. I didn't go through this for nothing. And this has never been about money. This is not about money for me. This is about God. And this is about healing. I'm sorry, I just get emotional because I've been through so much. Like, these lyrics didn't come out of my butthole. These lyrics came from crying for years for waiting for people who are never going to come for losing things that I can never replace losing people I'll never see again making mistakes that ruin lives and I'm hoping that maybe maybe God can forgive me for what I've done if I help other people not that I feel like I deserve to be forgiven because I've caused a lot of people a lot of pain and I really am sorry about that 
music is everything to me. Music is everything to me. I'm done. I love him. I love him so much. So I'm on my way back home now. Um, we spent the past hour mixing the song down. This is the first time I haven't had to outsource my mix because he's just that good. He's so good. So now I have to do a photo shoot with Judah for this. And uh, after we do the photo shoot for the, um, the cover, then I can upload it and it'll be available for y'all to hear. And so now I'm gonna finish up my other project and then finish my other song. And I should be back in the studio in the next two months. I'm gonna find every excuse to be in the studio with him because he is so talented, he's fine too.